All right, so here we have a JDM SDI cluster. Uh, has a socket in it, which I'll show you in a second. And right now it has the stock EEPROM ROM on it. So let's just power it on. Okay, see it displays the the kilometers and lights are on and yep. So now let's pulse it with a quote unquote speed or a speed signal. All right, boom. There's our speed signal. You can see it's right there and that. Yep, so that, that's all well and good. And so let's turn it off. And power it down. And pull this guy out. Let's come out with one hand. Perfect. So here we see the EEPROM there. And I will pull this out. Ooh. And let's put it in our writer here. like so. All right, and then we can change a value here. Boop, boop, boop. Change that to zero, zero. Sorry about that, boom. Boom, as we see it's changed, let's write it. Boom, boom. Let's verify it, make sure it wrote well. Verify failed, okay. That's cool. Let's write it again. No, oh, my right is failing. Hold on. Put the phone down. It helps if you put the EEPROM in the right way into your burner. <laughs> All right, so let's try writing it again. There we go. That's a right successful. Verify, verify successful, perfect. Undo this bad guy here. Plop it back into the socket. Trying to do this with one hand. <laughs> Trying, keyword. All right, hold on. go back in the socket let's put this guy back in here like a glove all right let's power it back up sweet as you can see same kilometers let's power this guy on and give it a speed pulse oh the tachometer went that time looks like i just found the section that controls where to send data to the tachometer sweet